Hello everyone, I'm Teacher Cole from Blue Tree Education. So in this video, we're going to go through Catholic High School Prelims 2022. We're going to go through the paper 2 questions. So let's go. Question 17. Raju used white and grey squares to form the following pattern, as shown. The table below shows the number of white and grey squares in each figure. Fill in the table for figure 5. Now, if you don't know how to do it, we just have to draw it out. It is not difficult to draw it out and add in the squares. And if I just draw it out the fifth figure and add in the squares, I realize that the number of squares, white squares is 12. Number of grey squares is 13. Right? So I can do that by just drawing. So what is the total number of squares in figure 40? The total number of squares, I'm just going to add in one more row. Total number of squares is 1. Total for figure 1. For figure 2 is 4. For figure 3 is 9. Figure 4 is 16. Figure 5 is 25. Do you see that all these numbers are square numbers? So if figure 1 is just 1 square, or 1 times 1. Figure 2 is just 2 times 2. Figure 3, the total is just 3 times 3, which is 9. Figure 4 is 4 times 4, which is 16. Figure 5 is 5 times 5, which is 25. So for figure 40, isn't it equals to 40 times 40, which is 1,600? So how many more white squares than grey squares are there in figure 40? Now to do that, let's look for patterns. Now can you see that the number of grey squares have a pattern? Do you see that the, the interval between the number of grey squares is always 3? Right? So 1 plus 3 will give you 4, plus 3 will give you 7, plus 3 will give me 10, plus 3 will give me 13. So it's a constant interval of 3. So which means, right, so to get to the second figure, I just need to add, use the first figure which is 1, plus 1 times of 3. Get to the figure 3, I add 2 times of 3. Add to figure 4, add 3 times of 3. So it's always 1 less than the figure number. To go to figure 5, I have to add 4 times of 3 to the first figure. So the, the, the pattern will be figure number minus 1 because always 1 less than the figure number times of 3 add to the first figure. So for figure 40, the number of gray squares I will have is 39 times of 3, right? 1 less than figure 40, 39 times of 3 add to the first figure which is 1. So if I know it's 1,118 grey figures, I will know number of white squares because the total is 1,600, right, which is calculated in part B. So 1,600 in total minus 118 grey will give me 1,482 white. And that will give me 1,482 minus 18 will give me 1,364 white squares more than grey squares. Alright, so that's all for this question and the whole paper. I hope you learned something. I'll see you again. Bye-bye.